Hey guys, it's Stu. Um, I'm afraid I've had a slight setback um, in regard to my builds, uh, which I'm afraid are going to have to go on hold for about a week and a half, uh, because unfortunately I have had major problems with my airbrush uh, this afternoon. Uh, reason being is basically the first instance was when I was actually applying the base coat to my Walker Bulldog and all of a sudden the paint was not coming out. So I assumed there may have been a blockage. Uh, naturally I stripped down the airbrush itself, cleaned everything through uh, with, th with airbrush cleaner and thinners. Um, um, tried to see if there was a problem. There was a slight problem with trying to reapply the needle back in, but uh, as far as I can see, it's not bent. Uh, so it was probably just where well, I wasn't fitting it properly. So I didn't hand fist it, put it in there, but it it fell it fell into place soon after. So I thought, right, okay, no problems there. Get it all. I've got it all cleared. Get everything up and running again. Uh, Went to apply the base coat again, and lo and behold, the same thing occurred again. Uh, got a slight amount of paint came out, and then all of a sudden, nothing. Airflow was going through fine, uh, there was just no paint feed coming through, and basically, the paint was coming out of this little crevice here, which you can see, full flow and basically round the other side as well uh, so the only thing I did was to strip it down again um, check that the needle wasn't bent which it wasn't because uh, I thought that I suspected that may be the case uh, it isn't uh, I've given it a thorough clean through again so I thought right let's just see if the flow is going to work again uh, put a little bit of white spirit in nothing was coming out and it was leaking either side of those crevices again um, so the only thing I can assume is that some seal inside which I can't get access to has cracked which may be affecting the paint flow from the cup to the airbrush and the needle so it's looking pretty terminal for this little beauty. Um, it's the first time I've had any problems with it in the last four or five months I've had her. Um, she's been a superb little airbrush. Um, I mean every coat I've given on my models has been absolutely flawless. Um, I might look into getting it repaired at some time in the future uh, so unfortunately all my builds are on hold for at least a week and a half I will however be ordering a replacement as I get my salary next week um, and it's going to be one that Chris from Chris and Alex Modeling Review which was the WD280 is it the Vida WD280 um, it's within my budget and apparently it's pretty uh, similar to an Awata, uh, but I may well invest in an Awata come December because I've got my uh, annual bonus coming up. Um, so that if anything should reoccur then I've got a spare airbrush. Okay. Um, basically before problems occurred I've managed to virtually get all the base coat down on the uh, Walker Bulldog with Matt Olive Drab as you can see there but I didn't quite get to the end and that's when the problem started occurring and I was hoping to get the running gear all uh, base coated but I couldn't um, as regards the R75 this is as far as I can get at the moment um, I may well do some little more detailed paint work on it with a brush uh, but that's as far as I can go I can't actually clear coat it and apply the decals until I get my new airbrush in and this is as far as I've got with the figures. Okay, so it's all coming together. But that's as far as it goes, guys. Um, um, so, as regards the uh, Secret Santa Buddy Bill, which Paul at ISM has organised, I'm still going to go ahead with it, Paul. Uh, don't worry, bud. Um, as I say, this is just a slight temporary setback. Uh, I have to say that I was watching last night's hangout today because uh, I couldn't watch it thanks to a certain person who was on his laptop. Great. 
um, because the picture kept freezing where he was using it and it was blocking my signal. So I was not a very happy chappy. But anyway, that's another issue. Um, anyway, getting back, I'm getting off the beaten track here. Um, I have to say, yeah, you guys were on fine form last night, and Clem, mate, ah, oh, brilliant. You really were coming out with them. <laughs> Uh, as well as Jermaine, uh, buddy, you were in fine form too, and of course Mike Cowan, uh, as well as Paul. Okay, guys, you just crack me up, uh, you really do. And the reason I've entered the uh, buddy group, uh, Christmas, well, Secret Santa uh, buddy build, is because I want to give something back to you guys, because you've been all a great help for me over the last year or so. Um, I've become more knowledgeable and... My skills have improved thanks to the advice you've all given me. Um, so thank you very much from the bottom of my heart. Okay, and you feel made me feel very much part of the modelling community. Anyway, that's it for now, guys. Uh, I'm sorry I can't get any further. Uh, but as I say, unfortunately, until I get my new airbrush in, there's not a lot more I can do. I'm feeling a bit frustrated about it because I'm 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 really getting into these builds, uh, loving every minute of it, and the results are just well, they speak for themselves. Um, anyway, all it remains for me to say is get kick crazy, happy modelling, and I'll see you on a video in the future. Bye for now.